Have you ever gotten to the end of a work day or school day and looked in the mirror and gone, whoa, and not in a good way? I know that I personally have had um, exo markers smeared across my face. My hair has been crazy. And then I go, oh my gosh, I still have to go run a ton of errands before I go home. So today we're going to find the solution for that. By the end of this video, you will have all the tools you need to make your very own desktop toiletry kit so that you can be prepared for whatever the workday throws your way. Hey, I'm Beth with Sheets and Systems, and I have helped hundreds of educators streamline their life with my digital checklist, and I decided it was time to start sharing my tips, tricks, and products with the rest of the world. So today we're going to be talking about something that I have made for myself and have made as a gift for several of my mentees and coworkers in the past, and every single one of them has come back and told me what an awesome gift it was, and that is a desktop toiletry kit. So you ready to dive in? Let's go. All right, so to make a desktop toiletry kit, there's a few steps. The very first one is you need the perfect box that fits in your desk nicely and keeps everything organized because what's the point in having a desktop toiletry kit to help you with all of your emergencies if you're having to dig through it to find stuff. I found the perfect box at Michael's and it was, they put their craft storage on sale 50% off all the time. And then if you're a teacher, you can add your discount. So this is what the box looks like. It's awesome. It clasps shut and all of the little um, dividers are movable so that you can make it fit whatever you need in your toiletry kit. Okay, step two. So you've got your perfect box. Now you need all the stuff to put in there. On my blog, I've listed and linked all of the things I have from Amazon. But honestly, a lot of my stuff I found at Dollar Tree, Target. The one thing I did have to get on Amazon though that is my favorite part of this entire box is my mini straightener. Um, it was less than $10 and it is perfect for a lot of times I honestly would come to school with my hair wet when I was a teacher and then I would straighten it real quick once it dried either during my planning or after school before I went somewhere. Um, and it is perfect for that. Let's take a look at all of the items that I keep in mind to give you some ideas for yours. I would love to know in the comments below if you will answer. Um, what is one must have item you would put in your desktop toiletry kit? Okay, you've got your box, you've got your stuff. Technically, you could be completely done with your toiletry kit, but if you wanna give this as a gift or if you just wanna feel super put together, adding a cover to the top of it, especially a laminated one, is a great way to do that. And I've got you. I've made six different um, toiletry kit covers, different color schemes, so you can pick which one you like best that are free and ready to go. They are linked below. All you have to do is print. If you wanna laminate, you can, and slap it up there, and you have a very put together desktop toiletry kit. Whew, and we are done. Less than two minutes and you've got a great new way to help yourself be prepared for whatever the workday throws your way. Um, any of the things I mentioned in this video, the box, the straightener, um, the cover, all of that stuff is linked below. And I have one more step. If you choose to make a toiletry kit, I would love to see it and share it with our community. So please tag me in any of the social medias where you might choose to share. You can email it to me, Facebook, Instagram, any of the places. All of that stuff will be linked at the end of this video and in the comments below. So I would love to see if you choose to make a desktop toiletry kit. See what you come up with. Thank you so much for watching. I would love to know what you think. Tell me by either hitting the like or dislike button below so that I know what you guys want to see. Last thing before I let you go is if you want to make sure that you don't ever miss a two minute tip video or any of the other videos I might come out with in the future, make sure you hit that subscribe button so that we can stay connected and you can always have new two minute tips to help you simplify and organize your life. I hope you have a great day and I'll see you later. Bye.